I honestly feel like Superwoman. It can be done, I'm proof I'm standing right here. It's a great time for women to be working in mining. I chose Canada because it's a very strong country in the mining culture. With the work that I'm doing, I am making a difference. I love that I'm doing something different every day. When you think of engineering and mining, images of big trucks in remote locations may come to mind. But a lot of planning and analyzing happens inside the city in offices like this. Denise Nunez is a senior engineer and lead metallurgist at JDS Energy and Mining Inc. My name is Denise Nunez. I am a senior engineer and the lead metallurgist for JDS Energy and Mining. Well, I am a metallurgist, so I separate uh, waste from valuable material like uh, gold or copper. How do you go about doing that? Well, I have to first of all break the rock and then find a way to drive what I want one way and why I, what I do not want in a separate way. So the flotation is uh, we, we make a slurry, so we mix the rock with water after in the grinding circuit and then we introduce bubbles to it and when the bubbles rise they carry what we need in the froth and that's collected and sold as a concentrate. You came to Canada as a skilled immigrant and now you're a Canadian citizen. What was the journey to get here? I came uh, to Canada first as an international student. It started with the curiosity to get to know a different culture and live elsewhere and I chose Canada because it's a very strong country in the mining culture. From your perspective, Denise, what would you say are some of the advantages of working in Canada in the mining industry as a skilled immigrant? It's the understanding of different cultures, right? Like I come from a, from a Latin background, so it's, for me it's, it's easy, I'm comfortable and, and have a, like an easy time to work with uh, people in different countries like uh, Mexico, Argentina, Chile, because I do have that background and, and that understanding of um, their culture. What kind of skills do you need to become a top-notch metallurgist and senior engineer? Good problem-solving skills and chemistry helps a lot, physics, uh, and it's, it's the science side of engineering. Listening skills are pretty good as well, right? You have to go listen to listen to the problem and think outside the box and find a solution, so that, that's what I do. Language skills are great skills to have. Uh, I can work uh, in any country that speaks Spanish, Portuguese or English, so that's definitely uh, a good asset to have in the mining industry because we work uh, everywhere. Give me a sense of what countries around the world you've worked in. Well, I have worked in Brazil, Ecuador, Chile, Argentina, Canada, Mexico, U.S., Australia. Wow, <laughs> it's a pretty long list. Yeah, it is, it is. It's fun. I like seeing different countries. Right now, how much time are you spending in the office and then how much out in the field? Nowadays, I'm about 50-50, so it's great. I have to spend some time in beautiful British Columbia, Vancouver, which I love and chose to be my, my home. And I also have the chance to travel to many different places, get to work with different people, different cultures, so it is, it's amazing. Give me a sense of the work you do here while you're inside the office. When I'm in the office, I keep receiving the data from the site. So I, I have the chance to analyze how the production is, prog is progressing, like how much gold, copper, silver, zinc or, or lead is being produced and then I can just help them to be more efficient. How do you help them be more efficient? I look at what is being fed to the mine and I see oh, that mineral seems to have a special challenge so we need to change the chemicals when that comes. 
So that way we build the knowledge to, to keep the process as efficient as possible. So just those small tweaks, for example, in the chemical makeup, that can make a big difference in yeah. the level of production? Absolutely. It can be a huge difference. It can, can improve like a couple of percent recoveries and that's, that's a big thing. If you had any advice for women who want to go into mining, what would you say to them? Go for it. It's a beautiful industry. Like We do more than digging holes. We generate jobs. We build community. I do believe we have a positive impact in the world, so just go for it.